Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the new full screen widgets in Windows 11 build 25201. So we have a new build for the dev channel and also new content, new hidden content from Microsoft. And in this video in particular, we're going to talk about widgets, but in the following days, I'm going to show you other hidden features that you can enable in Windows 11 build 25201. If you enjoy videos like these in which I show you how to enable different hidden features in Windows 11, especially in the dev channel, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video of course yet again we're gonna have to download and set up vive tool we're gonna have a download link in the article below in the description just go ahead and download the latest version after that make sure to right click on the archive and then click on extract all you don't need WinRAR or 7-zip or any other third-party software you can just use windows 11's official archive software and here you're gonna have to click on browse and extract this into system 32 and that would be this PC, local disk C, Windows, and then scroll down to System32, select it, click on Select Folder, and then click on Extract. In my case, I'm going to have to replace the files in the destination because I already extracted it, but it's no issue. In a few seconds, we're going to have Vive Tool extracted in the System32 location. After we extracted Vive Tool, we're going to have to open up CMD, so just open up the search box, type in here CMD, and then click on Run as Administrator. On User Account Control, of course, click on Yes, and here you're going to have to paste in this command, Vive Tool slash Enable slash ID 34300186. You should receive the message successfully set feature configuration and then you can exit out from CMD. In this case, you won't need to restart the system. You can just open up Task Manager. So right click on the Start menu, click on Task Manager, then go into the Details tab and press W on your keyboard to locate widgets.exe. Right click on it and then click on End Task and End Process. And after that, just exit out from the Task Manager and you can open up widgets and the process will be automatically opened and you will have this new option that will allow you to use the full screen mode for widgets. This is really interesting in my opinion and I think this is really cool but of course I'm hoping that Microsoft will introduce custom widgets because if we have a full screen mode we would want to have also more useful widgets in my opinion. Maybe only the weather widget is somewhat useful but I don't use other widgets than weather realistically. Now as I've said in the video that I've done yesterday widgets should automatically remember what the state that you've set for the widgets pane so if you set it to full screen next when you open up widgets it should open in full screen if you set it to half the screen as it is now it should remember that as easy as that right now this new feature doesn't have any options only you can set it to full screen and the windows will remember the state that you've set but hopefully in the near future microsoft will introduce more interesting features like custom widgets which is on the desktop and so on don't forget that the command used in this video will be in the article below in the description and if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.